Toronto is a place that you gotta be in the series because it's been for so many years and uh, it's a fun place. Toronto is an awesome place, an awesome city, you know, people enjoy to go. There is so much going on out there and, um, and, and again, it's always great to go to a place that was a lot of international people and uh, it's a lot of fun and uh, kind of like modern stuff, you know, so uh, can't wait to go back there. Uh, I think Toronto is a great place to show some good racing. Um, it's kind of the perfect setup of a track because it's got a really long straightaway with a hairpin, which makes for a very long brake zone, which makes for a lot of a lot of overtaking. So there are a lot of accidents because there's nowhere to go because there's walls. But you know that's part of racing, and um, I think uh, I think that if you can get down that straightaway and get inside people, um, you can have a really exciting race. Yeah, I think. Uh you know, like uh, Canada has always been a big part of motorsport throughout the years. Uh, uh, we've been lucky the series, you know, that we raced in allowed us to have races in Canada. I think, you know, Toronto is, is, is more an event than just a race. I think, you know, there's a lot of things happening downtown, street parties, things like this. And uh, it creates, you know, like good atmosphere. And my rule of thumb is pretty simple. If the guys really like arriving early at the track and leaving late and, you know, they, they like the circuit, it, it's it's going to make it for a good a good race because everybody wants to, to be involved. If you go to a race and you, <laughs> you show up the day of the practice and you leave the night of the race, obviously, you know, there's a trend and, and it says it all. So I think Toronto has good atmosphere. It's a cool track and, and I like it also because I've been successful there, a couple podiums and and um, I led, you know, the race uh, last year pretty much the, all the way and um, it was, uh, you know, it was fun.